Engineers are always looking to create stronger, lighter and more durable products. The National Composite Centre, one of seven centres in the High Valley Manufacturing Catapult, is accelerating that transition to new technologies and enabling commercialisation of high-quality composite components. Our reporter went to Bristol to find out more. The National Composite Centre was set up in 2009, a £75 million government-funded project to safeguard and advance the future of UK manufacturing. Hundreds of dynamic companies from all over the world collaborate with specialist research engineers to create world-class processes and products that are always cutting edge, often sustainable and sometimes revolutionary. For many years, the UK has been a brilliant researcher. But unfortunately, we let things escape to other countries. We didn't turn them into commercial value. Our job is to take those great research ideas, mature them, scale them up, de-risk them, and make them producible in industry. Right quality, right cost, uh, right rate of manufacture. And when they go into real products, make them work. So Ash, this has come out really well. If we could just try that out next time with a faster cure. Williams Advanced Engineering is the commercial arm of the F1 team. Collaborating closely with the NCC means the company can take F1 heritage, designs and ideas and apply it to large-scale production. Often this means new products to market are 40% lighter and made from 80% recycled material. Ultimately, it's about taking the racing car to the road car. The NCC is a fantastic place to come and use state-of-the-art equipment which enables us to trial and de-risk uh, some of the technologies that we want to bring to large-scale automotive and aerospace. An example of that is a recent collaboration that we had uh, producing suspension components for automotive and it's a very good message to take to the automotive industry. This is one of seven high-value manufacturing catapult centres in the UK, government technology and development centres that bridge the gap between academia and industry by taking new products from concept to commercialisation. Composites is a burgeoning industry. This centre has more than quadrupled the number of sectors it works with since it opened, as many more industries such as oil and gas and automotive are moving from the traditional materials to the lighter weight solutions that composites offer. There's a chronic shortage of engineers in this sphere and the NCC is taking steps to address that. What we found since we were first started six years ago is an incredible increase in the number of sectors working in composites and we're now working with something like 16 different sectors that enable us to develop different technologies. They all have different solution needs. So we're working with all of them. We can transfer technology and ideas from one area to another. Uh, and of course, we therefore need to develop people. We need people for ourselves, more people as we grow and as the industry grows, but we also need to develop people for our customers because they will need them in their workforce in the future. The NCC is taking on an escalating number of trainees, from those who have little or no experience of engineering or commodities to others whose engineering skills are transferable from other sectors via a conversion course, a type of finishing school for engineers. The composites industry is really rapidly expanding. It's a really exciting place to work at the moment and there are plenty of opportunities. There are more opportunities than there are people trained to, to fill them. So we're looking to reach out into the uh, engineers who are already accomplished and established in another discipline and look to give them that extra bit of training and composites awareness so that they can transition into our, our industry. Um, Monero Dynamicist by training and by making the transition across to the composites industry it's given me an opportunity to discover a whole range of manufacturing processes that I wasn't aware of before joining the NCC. I love everything that goes with composites, I love Formula One, I love automotive, I love marine and being at the National Composite Centre we get to be with the most cutting edge customers, machines, equipment and materials um, all in one place. The National Composites Centre, lightening the load for industry.